decades, the Chicago Children's Choir has helped tens of thousands of young people find their voice. It has truly been part, like a core part of my existence. It's been absolutely transformative. Ren Fetcher has been singing with them for nine years. This month, the organization rebranded, changing its name to Uniting Voices Chicago. We are very, very excited about the name change. I feel like Uniting Voices fits what we do as an organization better than Chicago Children's Choir because we are more than a children's choir. We are not only uniting the voices of our extraordinary youth, we are uniting the voices of our parents, our community leaders, of our city, our nation, and the world. The nonprofit's president, Josephine Lee, says they want to create a more harmonious world, harnessing the power of music. Uniting Voices has neighborhood ensembles all over the city and also works in Chicago schools. And we have two citywide ensembles that meet here at the C Chicago Cultural Center, an ensemble for changed voices, Dimension, and then we have the premier uh, Voice of Chicago that travels internationally and I'm thrilled to say we just got back from Egypt this summer and it was an absolutely epic tour. We went to Cairo, Alexandria, we took a boat down the Nile and we got to meet so many incredible people. It like seems surreal because it's like stuff that I only like dreamed of doing and it's like all of a sudden like my whole life has changed. <laughs> 17-year-old Elijah Williams first connected with the group in school in seventh grade. It's more than just a choir, it's like a family. He says the feeling on stage is... Exhilarating, like the energy that you get from the people around you, the energy that you get, that you receive from the crowd. Lee is energized and excited about the Uniting Voices partnerships. We have been partnering with the Chicago Symphony Orchestra, Lyric Opera of Chicago, and this year for the first time with the Chicago Opera Theater, King Roger Semenyovsky Opera. I'm thrilled about that. She says they may be evolving with a new name, but the commitment to impacting young lives remains the same. Music is a beautiful and the most powerful vehicle to connect people, to break down barriers, uh, and to unite all of us. I know I would not be who I am today without the help and guidance of Uniting Voices because they have given me a safe community to be myself and express myself through music. In the Loop, Gaynor Hall, WGN News. Give me